Hi everyone, this is Chris at Chris Marino Design, and I've been receiving a lot of questions lately about these interactive pop-up windows or navigation tabs not working in a browser or on a mobile device. And all we need to do is just make a few adjustments and export this PDF differently. And I'm going to open up the same document I had in part two. So if you haven't watched part two, I'm going to link it in the description below. And in part two, we exported this document as an interactive PDF and what we need to do is actually export it and publish it online. And I'm going to make a few adjustments to my navigation tabs on the side. The interactive buttons that we had already created in part two are just fine. So I'm going to go up to my master page and I've already done the first two buttons. Let's do this section two button. And I'm going to need to delete this go to destination action. And I'm going to add a new action. And the EPUB only version is going to allow me to go to a page. And that's exactly what I want. So section two is going to start on page four. Hit return. And I'm going to go to the section three button, delete the destination action add a go to page action and section 3 starts on page 6 hit return and I have already fixed section 1 and the table of contents so now that's out of the way go back to the main document and again instead of exporting this as an interactive PDF I'm going to go to this little icon up here and publish online. And you can title however you want. I'm going to leave it untitled for now. Click publish. And once this finishes, we're able to view the document. And this document now is opened up in our browser and it has full functionality. I can go to the navigation tabs on the side. It'll take me to the appropriate sections. Could I'll use, also use the right arrow over here and make sure the pop-up buttons are working. So I have my first click pop-up button that we talk, discussed in the part two video. I have my rollover pop-up button that works. I have my photo pop-up button that works. And I have my last button that actually has a hyperlink within the pop-up window. And that works too. Now all we need to do at this point is send this URL to our client. And our client will be able to open this up in a browser on a mobile device with full functionality. And that's it. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And I'll see you next time.